Today you're about to see something that you've never seen on this channel before. A cup game. It's not an England vlog either, by the way. It's not a Palace game in all competitions. We are going to be going to the Emirates, not to see Crystal Palace play, obviously, but to see Arsenal take on Leeds tonight. It is, um, I think it's Sunday the 6th of, sorry, Monday the 6th of January. They're playing Leeds at the Emirates Stadium, the FA Cup third round. I've never watched a game at Arsenal. Well, I mean, I have actually. If you all remember what happened last time when we were at the Emirates. <laughs> say um you know we won that palace won three by three goals or two i got a bit over excited and yeah you know uh it went on from there but no who cares we are arsenal are playing leads i'm not an arsenal fan obviously i'm a palace supporter i'm only going because my mate um who was in well he's in he was in one of my vlogs a month ago actually palace took on bournemouth you may remember kieran he was the one he's the one who's actually you know asked me to come to the game so credit to him shout out to him as well but no real talk um this game i am really i mean all I know is Arsenal have had a poor season, Leeds are going for promotion in the championship. So you know, a lot is expected. Um I'm gonna just I'm just gonna I'm just gonna go 2-0 Arsenal, that's my prediction for the game. I think they'll keep, I think they'll win and keep the clean sheet. I mean, that's such a good form. I mean, we're playing them this Saturday as well, 12.30 kickoff, so it's sort of nice for me to go there and see how they play, what their fans think, you know. Not for me to ask them, but for what they're saying and what they're thinking and how they're confident, if you know what I mean, just sitting in the ground in the tense atmosphere at the Emirates Stadium. So yeah, um, you know, um, I, I want, I don't know, I'm not sure what Arsenal team to expect. It's probably going to be their younger team or just, you know, their second team. And that Martin Erling, Nelson, Saka and Martinez and that in goal. You know what I'm saying? So let's stop waffling. And I will see you lot at the Emirates. Coming to the Emirates now, yeah. Just met Fogan. Check out his video. He's at the game tonight. I've got a picture of him as well. I'm gonna put it there. What are your predictions for the game, innit? 4-1. We're gonna go 2-0 two nil still, 2-0. Two nil. Who knows what's gonna happen, but we're just approaching the Emirates now. And um, yeah, um, should be a good game. So I'll see you lot in there. And uh, who knows what's gonna happen. Coming. Kieran, do the honours of the team lineup, Thank you know. You. Um, Martinez in goal. Martinez. Three centre backs: Socrates, David Luiz, and Rob Holden. Quite strong. That's a decent. Who else is in? Right wing back: Nelson. Nice. Nelson's alright. Yeah. Left wing back: right. Lasanac. Yeah. Two centre mids: Guendouzi, Xhaka. All right. Front three: Ozil, Pepe, and Lacazette. That is some strong side. That's a strong well, side. I'm, I'm going to watch some good football for once. I like that last shitty game against Derby. So, yeah, maybe my tune-up prediction might be a little more. Who knows? With this lead side and the Arsenal team as well, going to walk into the ground and yeah. Who knows, who knows, but it's looking alright right now, I just met Fergan, who knows, we might meet Troops or Robbie, depends. <laughs> Seems to be up for it, which is good. What a miss from Bamford. He hit the crossbar. Should have put that in for 1 0 to Leeds, to be honest. Thoughts? Shit. Need some liveliness. Exactly. Oh, yeah. Defensively, Arsenal just don't look stable. They're just ball watching and just giving Leeds too much room and letting them get goal side too much, to be honest. Oh, Ask me, corner. First one for them with the game in front of them. Intimidating lead supporters. Look at the supporters again, ready? Dude's looking around the Emirates right now. Not looking good. There should be one new up lead. Arsenal have been so poor, it's beyond description. So that was awful. Um, yeah, I mean, 
been surprised it's so bad this season, you know, it's not as good as expected. They fell out on Saturday against South Sudan and won the chance to beat them. Well, first half up. Lazy. Boring. I don't know what Fucking shit. You want shit? Yeah, fucking shit. It's what people say, isn't it? Passion, no heart. I think we'll get into it, but we need to get into it soon. Mm. Maybe a sub will liven it up or something. Who's on the bench that you've got that you think can make an impact? Because there's no Aubameyang, is there? Smith Rowe? Maybe? I don't know. I'd say Martinelli and some Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take Urzel off, maybe. Yeah, yeah, or Nelson. Who knows? They should have taken it, but so close, not far off. What are your thoughts? It's getting better. It's getting there. Uh, you lot seem to be more up for it, just, you know, pressing in that. Ooh. It's not perfect. It's nowhere near perfect, but it's getting there. I think as soon as the goal comes, I think that's it. They're yeah. fucked. Ooh. I think your 2 0 position Pepper. could be right. Yeah, probably. Arteta must have given him a right kick up the backside because this is a different answer side to compare to what I saw in the first half. The atmosphere's gone from 1 to 10, you know what I mean? They're in again. Ooh. Just play it away, you know. On top of Martinelli. Do you think that was a penalty? Yeah, I think we could have two. I mean, there's VAR and they're not checking it, so I'm so confused right now. You know what I mean? It's just, it's just messed up. Who's taking that? Footer. Left footer or right footer? Ooh, it's gone right into the lead supporters actually. I found it around the ball. I thought I was going to go into Rose straight away, you know? Well, it's for a red card, final conduct, but nothing given. Ooh. And they should have done better shot from Jesus. It's a free header there as well. Stand up, stand up. I like a foul there. Number five. 